Tonight on GDS, the perfect inside of summer activities for your kids during this heat wave, plus how Culture Shock is celebrating their birthday. Oh, it's a good day, stay live. Hi and welcome to Good Day State Line. Thanks so much for joining us tonight. It is Wednesday, June 15th, halfway through the week, and I think halfway through this heat wave too. The air is very thick out there. Stay hydrated, find a pool. Take a nap, do what you gotta do to survive. This weekend, it looks like things are gonna cool off just in time for Father's Day. We are gearing up for our big Father's Day surprise on Friday. We cannot wait to introduce you to this year's GDS Dad of the Year. We have a fun Father's Day a game for you tonight with one of our favorite dads, Eric Wilson, to get you in the Father's Day spirit. Plus, it's Wine Wednesday tonight too, and Culture Shock is in the house too with a whole bunch of stuff to tell us about, including some last minute Father's Day gift ideas too. But before we get to all of that, it is time for in to chat every night we're breaking down the latest trending hollywood stories here and inside our instagram story kicking things off tonight with the latest on britney spears wedding yes there is more to talk about <laughs> apparently her brother brian was not invited to the wedding despite original reports that he was invited so in case you missed it britney shared a lengthy note it was like five slides i think on instagram yesterday that clearly showed her feelings about her brother <laughs> that they are on par with her feelings about the rest of her family i would not be able to read this to you on the air i spent a good five minutes though reading it to myself when it popped up on my phone yesterday so why did we think he was invited to this wedding turns out his girlfriend told the press that he wasn't at the wedding because it was at the same time and day as his daughter's elementary school graduation However, the real reason he wasn't at the wedding is because he wasn't invited. You should read, um, when you have the time, read Britney's note inside her Instagram story. Another story we're revisiting tonight, that Marilyn dress that Kim Kardashian wore to the Met Gala looks to be damaged. According to historian and collector Scott Fortner, who shared photos of the dress online. So Scott is a Marilyn Monroe enthusiast. He has photos from 2016 where he visited the dress. So he has those original photos, he calls them. And also photos from this past week when he went to go see the dress again. He says the dress is missing crystals and some of the crystals that are there are hanging by threads. The dress is out and on display just right there in public for anyone to see, just like it was prior to the Met Gala at Ripley's Believe It or Not in Hollywood. You can see those photos inside our story as well. And so many people are talking about this. The Joker sequel tonight after news broke that the movie could be a musical starring Joaquin Phoenix and Lady Gaga. So this is all still in the works. Maybe it'll happen, maybe it won't, but signs are pointing to Gaga playing Harley Quinn in the sequel to Joaquin's Joker. Uh, there's a lot going on with this. It sounds like it could be a dark, scary musical, which I think Lady Gaga would be really good at. You can follow it inside the Good Day State Line Instagram story. Make sure you're following us. You can always get more there as well, including what Gwyneth Paltrow recently said about her former fiance, Brad Pitt. We'll be right back with Skyler from Culture Shock. He's hanging out in the Mahoney and Mahoney Blue Room. We'll check in with him next. 